Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into an intriguing topic that could affect the future of lunar exploration. Recently, scientists discovered that the moon is shrinking, and it might be causing moonquakes and landslides, particularly in the South Pole region. Before we start, don't forget to join our community by hitting that subscribe button below. Show us some love by giving it a thumbs up and hey, if you found something valuable or entertaining, why not share it with your friends? Now let's explore the details and discuss how this could impact upcoming Artemis missions. Our story begins with the moon's fascinating history. The moon used to be hotter, but over time it has cooled down. This cooling process has led to a surprising consequence. The moon is actually shrinking. Don't worry, it won't collapse like a souffle, but just like a grape turning into a raisin, the moon is developing wrinkles. Let's find out more about how this affects the lunar surface. New research has delved into the impact of recorded moonquakes on the lunar surface, especially around the South Pole, a crucial area for future exploration. The study reveals that some slopes in this region are particularly vulnerable to falling apart due to these moonquakes. To explain further, I'll let Professor Nicholas Schmer from the University of Maryland take it away. Think of the moon's surface as dry, grounded gravel and dust. Over billions of years it has been hit by asteroids and comets causing fragments to be ejected. The reworked surface material can be micron-sized to boulder-sized, all very loosely consolidated. Loose sediments make it very possible for shaking and landslides to occur. Now, let's talk about shallow moonquakes. These quakes aren't very deep, occurring from 50 to 220 kilometers below the surface. Though less powerful than Earth's quakes, they can last for hours, making them a concern for future lunar exploration. Lead author Thomas R. Waters has some insights into this. Our modeling suggests that shallow moonquakes capable of producing strong ground shaking in the South Polar region are possible. This could result from slip events on existing faults or the formation of new thrust faults. So, what does all of this mean for upcoming lunar missions, especially the Artemis missions? Professor Schmer emphasizes the importance of considering potential seismic risks when planning the location and stability of permanent outposts on the moon. Let's hear his thoughts. As we get closer to the crewed Artemis mission's launch date, it's important to keep our astronauts' equipment and infrastructure as safe as possible. This work is helping us prepare for what awaits us on the moon. And there you have it, the moon is shrinking, and it's causing some lunar unrest. As scientists continue to study seismic risks, it's crucial for us to keep an eye on how these findings might impact the future of lunar exploration. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more space-related updates. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.